Let me show you how to cable forefront to make a left slanting cable. Cable patterns are formed when stitches are moved from one position to another in the same row by crossing them over each other. It involves slipping stitches onto a cable needle and holding these at the back or the front of the work while the next few stitches are worked. The held stitches are then knitted off the cable needle creating a rope-like pattern called a cable. We are going to work the cable for front technique on these four stitches. First, take a cable needle. I prefer to use the U-shaped cable needle from Clover. As you would when making a purl stitch, insert the short end of the cable needle into the first stitch and slip it onto the needle. Repeat the same with the second stitch. Swivel the cable needle downwards to the front of the work and simply let it hang. Next, knit two stitches as you normally would, pulling the working end of the yarn to tension the first stitch. Then once you've worked those two stitches, we're going to pick up the cable needle and swivel it round so that the two stitches are at the end of the long end of the cable hook. Then knit the two stitches on the cable hook. They will feel a little tight when knitting, so I usually use a cable needle slightly smaller than the main needles to make knitting these two stitches easier. You have now completed the cable four front stitch. You can clearly see the slant to the left. To learn how to make a right slanting cable, please see my separate video tutorial on the cable four back stitch. For more knitting tutorials, visit the Knit with Pat YouTube channel and for original knitting and crochet patterns, patriciacantosdesign.com.